Yeah, what's going on everybody? It's your boy iPod King Carter here. In today's video, I want to talk to you guys about NBA 2K24 and the NBA 2K23. Now, as far as NBA 2K24 goes, I wanted to update you guys on the crossplay information that I dropped yesterday. Now, you guys can still go check out that video, but if you did watch that video, I appreciate it. Thank you for the likes. Thank you for the comments. But the little bit of tidbit information that I did not give you was that NBA 2K24 will be crossplay for PlayStation 5 and Xbox Series X and S, right? But there will not be any cross progression. I'll break that down in a second. What there will be is crossplay as well as sharing currency in your My Team account. So, what that means is as far as pro cross progression goes, that's like creating a build on Xbox, right? M put, taking that build to 80 and then traveling to a friend's house for the weekend and loading up on his ps5 and and logging into your account and downloading an xbox build from the cloud for your playstation that won't be like that you won't be able to create a, a build on playstation 5 and then take it to xbox and keep progressing it okay you'll only be able to create your builds on whatever console you have but you will be able to play the other console in an online fashion also thing two there will be an option to turn off crossplay i repeat there will be an option to turn off crossplay set so the third thing actually when it comes to the whole crossplay effect of xbox and playstation i i might have mentioned it a little bit in my crossplay video but when it comes to vc and my team content that will be the only Thing that you can take cross plat which means if you purchase vc on playstation 5 and you go over your friend's house for the weekend and he has an xbox and you say oh man i just i just need to create an xbox build real quick you can use the vc that you purchased on playstation that before the weekend came on your new xbox build okay so remember no cross progression but you can take your currency and your my team account cross plat all right so i know cross play is a lot and i know you know it's a lot that we got to swallow it's a lot of information that we got to take in and all the last thing i'm gonna say about this before we hop into the nba 2k23 portion of this video nba 2k24 will not have pc a part of any cross play this year last gen which is playstation 4 and xbox one will not have crossplay. I'm not going to tell y'all what to do with that information. Just take that in. PlayStation 4, Xbox One, and PC will still have the old rendition of the game. And they will not be playing crossplay. They will not be cross-generation with each other, which means you will not be able to play with PS5 players if you're on PS4. If you're on Xbox One, you won't be able to play with Xbox Series X people on the next gen version of the game now pc players i know a lot of y'all are like bro why is there not a next gen pc game yet i'm right there with y'all i don't think that 2k is going to put a bunch of resources into the next gen experience of pc until they get a grip on what it actually takes to run that on a natural like budget build or uh, out of the box pre-build like something you would get from like a best buy i'm not talking about a micro center mwah, top of the line you know 40 90 crazy i 11 12 like no they're talking about a dell 500 with eight gigs of ram of uh, 250 to 500 uh gigabyte hard drive and a, and a goddamn a ti shit not even a ti this is motherfucking like a, a regular NVIDIA, maybe 1650, a 1050, maybe. Like, that's what 2K runs their PC games on. They run them on those to make sure that they're stable and make sure that anybody with a PC of that magnitude can run it, which means all of the other high-end, mid-tier PCs can run it too. That's their baseline. So if they have to now raise the bar and like literally raise the bar they're they're now telling people 
your PC can no longer cost six hundred and fifty dollars to play our our game. Your your PC can't cost five hundred, five fifty, six hundred, six fifty. You're now going to need a thirteen hundred to sixty five hundred dollar PC in order to play our game. And when I mean minimum of thirteen hundred to fifteen hundred, that's like bare minimum. Like you might be lagging a little bit, frame drops. You might have to take down the textures. You know what I'm saying you can't run it in no type of medium to sixty five hundred. I'm talking about ultra, all the best frames, all the and it's an online experience and we know what online experience games look like on pc if you don't have the best of the best your frames will drop there will be marshmallow buildings in the background there will be jitter and stuff like that and that's what they're trying to stay away from also pc y'all know y'all the king of the mods i won't call y'all hackers y'all modders and i love it i love watching modders do what they do to video games it's amazing some of it is outlandish and funny but some of it is also creative and i never want to stop a, a creative's bag you feel me I, I would love for creatives to always get in their bag because guess what that's where jobs lie because when you're a top modder for the next couple years somebody might pick you up and hire you think about that that's food for thought King Kong. King Kong. King Kong. Let's talk about NBA 2K23. I got a problem. Mm -hmm. I got a problem. It's a lot of people in my comment section talking a whole lot of talk. Matter of fact, you know what? I'm going to keep it about all the way candid with y'all. Y'all my dick. Yeah, iPod just said that. You on my dick. Chill out. Sometimes you have to realize I'm the creator. I'm the person making the content. I'm the person trying to get this content out to you. Blood, sweat, tears, fingertips, editing, making thumbnail, the whole shebang, streaming, everything. It's me. IKC Nation is not going to keep going for this shit. If y'all think y'all gonna come to the comment sections trolling, IKC Nation gonna stomp you out. The mods is gonna get right with you. You be in the YouTube comments talking about my money, talking about I'm on somebody payroll, talking about I'm getting paid to promote the game. You just, you speculating, my niggas. You're speculating. You don't know what I do for my breach, bruh. But I got a family to feed, and I will not let none of y'all play me. Yo, what, yo, what my man Kai say? Why you on my dick? <laughs> Word. Right. Get off my dick. Indeed. Indeed. <laughs> Word. Indeed. Get off my dick. Word. <laughs> why you on me like that? Why? Why is it? Why is it so hard to realize? You know what? This boy iPod got a good head on his shoulders. You know what I'm saying? He tried to keep it real as much as he can. He always trying to come with the news when he can. You know what I'm saying? He's always trying to be the first to it to make sure that he can give it to us. Why not? Why not be cool with that? Why do you have to go to the negativity route? Why do I have to get caught with strays when 2K do something? You know what's crazy? I wasn't even supposed to talk about that, but I just wanted to get that off my chest. Get off my dick. It's that simple. You know what I'm saying? Like, IKC Nation is good here without you. I'm telling you, we we are thriving. We are having fun every single day. I got a smile on my face, brothers, sisters. I am I am loving life. I have a great life. I am very blessed and thankful, super thankful. But y'all ain't going to get no energy from me. Y'all be like, why I probably don't respond to nothing? Because I don't need to. They don't make my day. Zebo make my day. Zebo is going crazy. <laughs> he in the steps. I don't. I don't know what he's talking about. But yeah, let's go ahead and um talk about what the community was actually talking about. Um, it's crazy because this stems off of something. Oh, by the way, subscribe to the YouTube channel. YouTube they've been making shit easy. I don't know if y'all know about the update, but they got home video shorts, lives, playlists, community membership, store channels, and about. They got all this stuff. They got they got so much here. 
that you ain't gotta you ain't gotta do nothing no more like you can just come to the joint watch the vids watch popular vids make sure y'all subscribe to the cell squad you know what i'm saying like they got all this stuff here but what i want to talk to y'all about is this poll right so me swante double h laker fan boom uh who else ej it was it was a bunch of different creators and, and um pro am players and and league players and stuff like that inside of a uh, uncle demi twitter space now this was supposed to be geared to what we would like to see in nba 2k24 um what we hoping is in nba 2k24 what we look forward to in NBA, like you know what i mean just just trying to figure out what 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 we're gauging what we want what the community wants as far as the community of twitter now i said this even in the twitter space twitter is not the only community of nba 2k nba 2k's community lies on so many different platforms under so many different tiers of creators as well as reddit pages like you can't just say oh akc nation is the end all be all of the nba 2k community it's not like that you have akc nation that are only on twitter you got akc nation that's only on instagram akc nation that's only on tiktok akc nation that's only on twitch akc nation that's only on youtube it's so many different tiers of viewers and and and, and commenters and people that have an opinion about the game on all these different platforms and that's for every single creator and it's multiple platforms of the game you got pc xbox playstation nintendo so you got mobile you got so many different people from all different walks of life that are a part of the 2k community so you know we had the twitter space and we was talking about things and demi said something crazy to me and swante he was like his community actually loves nba 2k23 like they like the game and i was like oh i was like for real he was like yeah man he was like i did a poll you know what i'm saying like the poll like it, it literally it overshadowed every other poll that they love nba 2k now when we talk about uncle demi he's like the build guy like if you need a, a replica build that's where you go to get your information because he's going to help you out with all the replica builds you dig so i was like you know what i've never gauged that like that as far as ikc nation go so i decided to make that poll and as you guys can see here on screen i made this poll nine days ago i made it literally the same night we did the actual uh twitter space and with 1.1k votes 69 percent of people said that they are not enjoying nba 2k23 so far 69 percent now when demi was making his his spiel about his fan base he was saying that his fan base are mostly casuals people that like to create builds you know um also like to get the watch gameplay of him using these builds because they can't do those certain things with those builds and i wanted to kind of like gauge ikc nation where it's like oh i wonder what my community is like and what i've realized is my community is full of my career players meta gamers and meta gamers is not a bad thing at all um people who like to watch tutorials people who like to hear news people who like to hear a uh, uh, um unbiased opinion as well as people who are learning to become comp players learning to become uh pro-am players learning to become league players like so like there aren't too many entertainment people on my channel like y'all don't really come to my channel for entertainment y'all like to come here for news and stuff and people are following me on twitch why okay <laughs> appreciate that uh whoever that is so pete let's go down the comments real quick i know i don't want to hold y'all up too long but y'all can go to this poll here y'all can vote y'all can drop a comment and i'll be i'll be looking over this poll until it's 14 days old now somebody said that they passed on 2k23 but interested in seeing what they bring to the table for 2k24 so this person hasn't even played the game at all. Some people, um, he said, people don't like it. I'm enjoying it. So that's one of the people that's enjoying it. He said, it's a few mechanic issues and high VC, but I'm enjoying the game overall. It's horrible how you make a basketball game without defense. 
sometimes when you fill the meter up it don't always go in overall it's broken now terry's comment it seems to me that he doesn't understand that what the hell is that he doesn't understand that it is green or die right now he i don't think he understood that that news had dropped when the game dropped that you had to green every shot and he also is saying that how you make a basketball game without defense so he's saying that defense is bad and he can't hit any shots so he's gonna have to you know work on himself you feel me um this person said i stopped since 19 been playing ever since 2k9 quit because it's good, other good games out and 2k got repetitive i can understand that it is a basketball game it's not really too much more you can do with basketball i mean we've been watching basketball for 50 plus years 75 years you know what i mean like it's basketball um i like it and i love my six two three point shot creator got another person that loves the game i have my moments but rarely now so this person has his moments where they like the game but they really don't like the game right now always will enjoy 2k it's the people that are not enjoyable bum, 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 bum. hold on this sums it up bruh always will enjoy 2k it's the people that are not enjoyable i'm that type of person that's the spectrum that i sit on i sit on the spectrum of i gotta learn a new game fuck let me go ahead and take some time to learn a new game all right i'm enjoying the game all right motherfuckers don't want to play that's that's where that's where i go that's the phases I, the game comes out I learn everything about the game. I start to play the game real heavy and then people start dropping out and not playing the game. And when I have to find new people or I play with randoms, it is an experience. It is an experience. I'll tell you that. Not all randoms are bad. I'm not saying that, but ooh, some people, boy, they be on your ass, boy. Um, what do you mean so far? A new 2K comes out in a couple months, but to answer your question, um have played since like october so this person hasn't even played the game since october um what do you mean so far it's been almost a year um these these are troll comments by the way this, i mean you know what i mean um they're not really telling me anything else um on top of being a bad basketball game 2k is just a sloppy game in general how many of the badges in the game are less powerful versions of other badges and then how many badges just straight up don't work terrible monetization gameplay is decided by which animations you get rather than your actual skill the game runs like garbage on next gen first and foremost when you say the game run like like garbage on next gen i don't know if that's completely true because i i play i played the game 12 hours a day almost every day i didn't really run into too many issues but when you talk about terrible monetization um the gameplay um being decided on which animations you get and not skill there's a lot of truth to that because if you get a quick drop you know what that mean if you get a lebron james step back you know what that mean if you get a stop and go blow by you know what that mean if you get a clan breaker you know what that means so there there are plenty of situations where all of this shit is based on what animations you get especially to shout out to my all my meta gamers out there people who meta game which means they come on YouTube, they find the best build, find the best animations, best jump shot, best dribbles, best dunk packages, and then go crazy. I wouldn't want to stop your fun, but some people would think of that like, yo, I can't stop this shit. Duh, it's the best animations in the game. Nobody came out with a video saying the best defensive animations in the game. Guess what? Guess why? There are no defensive animations. There are no certain swipes, no certain steals, no certain uh, blocks, no certain an block animations or anything like that. They don't have that. But if they did, would that be a game changer? I don't know. I might be talking out of turn. Um, haven't played in months. Um, everything about the game mechanics just sucks, to be honest. Everything sucks. My only hopes is for EA Sports NBA Live game to make a comeback. If ever, it would definitely make a big change on the real, to be honest. I don't, I don't, I don't know that to be true. Um, EA was, was out in 18 and 19. We got a good game out of 19. Pretty good game out of 20. But after that, it was over um and what i mean about it is ea stopped making the game after 19. all right um it's not as good as previous 2ks clamps don't work 
Interceptor badge doesn't um, intercept passes that come right to you. You tip everything. There are no badges for 50-50 balls, which I believe is supposed to be workhorse. Um, ankle breaker barely works. Special delivery delivery only is reliable on Hall of Fame. The matchmaking still stinks. Nobody likes the city. Need I go on? So many fucking valid points here. Um, the biggest one is Interceptor. They toned it down. Um, clamps never worked. Especially when somebody has clan breaker, GG's. Um, you you tip everything. I swear you can you can put your hand up like this and you tip the ball. You don't you don't catch them all the ways. Um, the 50-50s, workhorse on gold and above does work for me. Like if I'm going for a loose ball, we we always run for loose balls. That's 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 what we do. We scrappy. You know what I'm saying? Um, special delivery on Hall of Fame is crazy, especially with the bounce oops and off the glass oops and stuff like that. But like they're saying, Hall of Fame level is. It's the top tier. You know what I'm saying? Like, you got to have it or else. Um, the matchmaking still sucks. Um, as far as matchmaking goes, I haven't had any issues with matchmaking going into the uh, wreck by myself. Um, maybe maybe it's Pro-Am that they're talking about. Um, going into the theater, I haven't had any matchmaking issues. I don't I don't know what he's meaning by ma matchmaking, but, you know. Um, nobody likes the city. Um, the city is too huge. It's too much going on. Um, we got to travel... 700 to 800 meters from one part to another that's the that's the map that i have in my head 700 to 800 meters yeah you can use the tunnel and stuff like that yeah but you got to still run to that tunnel you know what i'm saying like so to get to another park is like man it takes forever sometimes um uh, i feel like people don't enjoy it um or trash or don't have a squad to run with to be honest it's not that bad and sometimes that's actually how it is sometimes a person will get off work four o'clock Get on at five. That's when all the kids are out from school. All the kids are in communication with their homies. They getting on threes. They they taking over the randoms court with a squad. And you getting off work. You don't got no grown ass friends to help you out. And you ain't talking to nobody kids. You gonna have to sleep in that. <laughs> like that's that's exactly what be going on. Stop playing earlier uh each year. Okay. Um stop playing it months ago. I recently deleted that trash game. Why would you make us grind a level 40? Just for it to be level 30 reward next season. Um, damn, he must have got mad about the mascots. Damn. Yeah. Um, I don't have NBA 2K23, so I don't know. Damn, I would I, I would have loved to get a uh, you know, to see what it would be like for you to get the game. Dang, um, it's it's free on PlayStation Plus. Um, bring back quick stopping, take out adrenaline boost, add cross play, speed up gameplay, shouldn't be delayed, take out the jump shot speeding up and random load ups. Valid points here. Every dribbler that I've talked to in the last few months always have been screaming, quick stop, quick stop, quick stops, quick stops, quick stops. Bring quick stops back. It it gotta be some truth to it. If IKC Nation, this is not a this is not a YouTuber that is that is huge that is a dribbler. This is one of IKC Nation members saying, yo, bring back quick stopping. Take out the adrenaline boost. The adrenaline boost has hindered everyone, even me. I use stop and go offense now. I don't I don't chain many moves together unless they're moves that don't uh, require too much adrenaline boost so that when I use my speed boost, I get three of them per possession unless they shoot that ball. So, you know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm in the same boat as you. Add cross play. We got cross play. Well, for next gen only. Um, speed up gameplay. Shouldn't be delayed. I don't know what that means. Um, maybe what they're saying is... Uh, they need better hardware, like they need to be Ethernet in, they need to be cabled into their PlayStation or Xbox and on a monitor with a one millisecond delay. Don't play on a TV ever. <clears throat> Take out the jump shot speeding up and random load ups. 100% understand that. In order to um, try to take the Zen out of commission, they had to change the jump shot timings and speeds depending on what pass animation you get, what catch animation you get. You know, like a whole bunch of different things, as well as the standing uh, triple threats, like the Kobe triple threat and all that. Like all of these random load ups come from those triple threat styles. So if you put on like MJ and you put on Kevin Durant jump shot, you might get like a crazy weird load up where it looked like the mother you about to shoot that bitch from the hip. You know what I'm saying? Type time. Whereas though some of the jump shots, you catch it and with Kobe and you got like, uh, you know, probably... I would say jump shot 11 and he pull that, he pull that jump. As soon as he catch it, he pull it. You know what I'm saying? Like it's no real triple threat motion or movement or nothing like that with your player. So 
that's that's what i think about that for sure all right uh kc nation i appreciate y'all for watching this video thank y'all so much man let me know what you guys think in the comment section how are you enjoying nba 2k23 as of right now or if at all i would love to know what you guys think about in the comment section sometimes i know me posting polls on the community tab you not might not always see that but i know that you guys see the video so make sure y'all tap in, in the comment section i want to hear what y'all think man um as far as more nba 2k24 news on the way every time some drop i got y'all you know what i'm saying make sure you tell a friend to tell a friend sub up and i'll see you on the next one peace King Kong, King Kong, King Kong, Abba. King Kong, King Kong, King Kong, Abba. King Kong, King Kong.